Yeah, yeah. it's kind of the tree. Yeah. Wednesday, you're gathered in the corner. <laughs> yeah, we gathered in peace. <laughs> it's currently 11 something. We had a slow morning. Yeah. But that's alright. We're gonna go for a mini walk. walk, walk. So we're bringing our backpacks today. I can say it was pretty heavy to just carry bags, honestly. A purse. Because uh, you always have to bring something for the rain. Um, bringing water bottle and just like essentials. Going for a little up in the hill hop. I can't even say hike, oh. walk. Yeah. Then we're gonna go to this like Mary. The real Mary King's Cross. The real Mary King's Cross. A walk. Which is the underground tour of the city. Pretty much. So we booked tickets for that because we made the mistakes and not pre-book tickets for the, yeah, the, the castle. castle. We didn't really know. We thought it was gonna be, you could buy the same day because when we went to Italy for, yeah. uh, to Rome for Colosseum, we were able to like get tickets the same day. Mm -hmm. That's fine, we've seen it from afar, yeah. up close. So that's the plan. Uh, yeah, let's just take this day as it comes, shall we? It's our somewhat last day in, in Scotland. Mm -hmm. Yeah, tomorrow we're heading on to our next destination. Let's soak up the day. The d weather looks like it's been looking. Bright, cloudy, sunny, a little bit of everything. On our last day in the city, because we weren't able to see the castle, we decided, okay, let's go to Carlton Hill. We've seen this spot from the restaurant, from the neighborhood that we stayed in. And we decided just to walk up and kind of just see what this place was all about. And it turns out it has this huge monuments. Uh, I guess one of them is an unfinished national monument. Look at this beautiful mess here. It also had a contemporary gallery, huge park area in a sense. And you can see the ocean all the way over there as well. And then when we look the other direction, you can see the old town, which is pretty cool. Well, not yeah, from here, not from here. Earlier. Yeah. So. If you want a free tourist attraction, we recommend this place. Yes. Right now, we're, right now. we're at Carlton Hill. Carlton Hill. That's a free tourist attraction for us. Yes. We the view of Arthur's Seat, which is another pretty known hike in Edinburgh. But for this trip, we just didn't really have the time for it. Let's so out there and start walking up. been walking down and so that will be for another trip i would say though that this was a very peaceful way of starting in the morning we made a mistake of not bringing lunch so we had to go down after this and grab some lunch but as an overall if you kind of just want to walk around and the weather was amazing it was really warm like soak in some nature some good views and also a tourist attraction that is free i would recommend just quickly walking up to Colton Hill and just enjoy the greenery. Doing the frets? Happy? Like we're back in America. Period. This is what we're doing now. How do you think about the tour? How do you think that's an awful movie? What do you well, think about the tour? I think it's actually like a 10 out of 10 of the tour. Yeah, and she was really yeah. good. Like her knowledge, she was and perfect. The information is great. Yeah. You, you won't find it anywhere else. Yeah, so we definitely recommend trying this yeah. out. After we finished at Mary King's Cross, which I highly recommend, the guide was amazing and a lot of great information. We walked for maybe 20, 30 minutes down to the palace. Love walking around the view and all the things that we see on the way, like the buildings, the people, it's incredible. But we decided to not purchase tickets to go into the castle area. We could see a lot from the gates 
and we were fairly tired so we figured we probably just gonna room around and then head right back out and we didn't feel like it was worth paying for it at that point um but absolutely in different circumstances i think it's just worth taking a trip down to the palace just done with makeup put on an outfit which today is quite simple yeah we're just doing this t-shirt in these jeans some earrings and that's that yana is wearing her um painting dress you've been really great at wearing dresses on this trip yes i love wearing dresses so it's currently shining. I forgot to turn on the electricity when I charged my phone. Nothing was charged. <laughs> I mean, you have the... Well, I didn't have 54%, so it was quite serious. No, but you have the... Portable charger. Yeah. But let's talk about that for a second, shall we? It's a disgrace. Um, and like I've been charging it for a while, so maybe I should just leave the button on. I don't know, we'll see. We're pretty much almost ready. We're gonna do a little first check and then we're gonna head out of here. And uh, we have dinner reservations in about like 11 minutes, but it's like right around the corner. So, let's that's a bottle of rose. Oh, It's officially packing day. Packing day. We're getting the fuck out of Scotland. <laughs> no, it was a pleasant trip. Yes, it was lovely to be in Scotland. We loved Edinburgh. It's great. But it's time to head down to the UK. Well, we are in the UK. It's time to head down to England. <laughs> so as you can see, it's like full packing on here and suitcase. So. We're gonna pack it up. We're gonna have our morning meeting, aka breakfast. And that's it for the Edinburgh vlog. So thank you guys for watching. I hope this was a lot of great information. Also, I'm gonna see you guys in our next city. Bye.